Established back in 2006, Isho Arts Center is the brainchild of artist Carol Caramera and a group of her colleagues, and is an ambitious organization that promotes art and culture in Rwanda. Isho Arts Center is a local organization. We are an NGO uh, trying to promote contemporary art in, in Rwanda and make culture available for everyone. So we do training for professional artists, we do creation, production, uh, we do um, advocacy work, uh, for the development of culture in Rwanda and we try to play the role that Rwanda is already playing is to be a bridge, a culture bridge between uh, the past, the present, the future and between Central Africa and East Africa. Their latest project entitled We Call It Love involves music and intends to spread sound all over the country. So We Call It Love is to try to discover this part of humanity in all of us and uh, to show the light and not only the dark uh, side of the past. So we have three different levels. The first one was a show for little children from four years old to teach them how to think about uh, the genocide and because they feel everything. They feel that we are missing people in the, in the, in the city, in the country. And uh, we try to see how we can work with this new generation and let them know what happened in the past. The second part is it's um, it's a dialogue between a woman who choose to give all the love that she had for her lost ones to the person who needs it the most, who needs the most, uh, the, the, the person who killed her loved ones. And the last part is the biggest one, it's an installation, a multidisciplinary uh, dis disciplinary, sorry, installation, mixing videos and sound. So we are trying to do a cathedral of sound to explore the random memory, but the musical, the sound of the nature, the voice, the, the words. And we would like to have this cathedral of sound moving all around the country. And I would like to see randoms coming in for 30 minutes, two hours, even sleeping in it, and, and listen to other people's memories or new memories that we're trying to do for the next generation, or maybe some music that we forgot. Uh, some sounds from the past, really, uh, because we work with uh, four different generations of artists on that project, to see that memory on Rwanda is not only Chunamu. And uh, Rwanda exists for more than one thousand and a half million uh, years. Uh, so it's, this is something that we try to recall and say that if we cherish that memory, if we transmit it, if we don't, if we don't talk, if we just keep silence, and if we continue to cherish the unsaid, the future of Rwanda will won't be so bright. So we're trying to help people to think about that and see if 21 years later, we can have a different relationship with our own memory. The group of artists involved in the project comprises of a mixture of experienced musicians and up and coming artists, all looking to make a mark on Rwandan culture. It's about memory. So I like it. There's a part that will be saying the memory of the future. It's kind of abstract, but I like it because it's about telling the future, telling our kids what, what we want to tell them. And I really like abstract things. I really enjoy it. I can give what I think could build the lives of people, people out there, because uh, it's, uh, there's a therapy in remembering. There's a therapy in keeping the memory uh, of those we loved or uh, everything we, 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 we met on the way, on our ways. So for me, I think I'm going to help people to think about their, 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 their future, but uh, through thinking the past. I'm, I'm, I'm a part of it, first of all, because it's about Rwanda, and it's about uh, the genocide, and it's about peace, because as we remember, we are rebuilding our peace in our society. So. As a Rwandan artist, I just have to use my arts to be part of Rwandan peace. Yeah. The project is slated to begin this summer, and by the looks of this rehearsal, it's something not to be missed. Makeda Mahario, Rise and Shine Rwanda. <laughs> Child and child. Oh,